Paul Klein, lead singer of the Los Angeles-based band Lanny, said it was a dream come true for them to stage a two-night concert in Manila. He exclaimed, Thank you for making my dreams come true. I'll come back for the rest of our lives. It seems like Paul still remembers the very first time the band came to Manila for the Wonderland Music Fest in March 2017. The fact that they weren't the concert headliner back then but got the most overwhelming response from Filipino fans prompted Paul to promise that they will return to Manila for a solo concert. They did come back for a series of mall shows in August 2017. But it was for this third visit to the Philippines that Lanny headlined a major solo concert. The band was nothing but grateful for receiving so much love from their Pinoy fans. At one point, Paul exclaimed, This is crazy. We're Lanny from Los Angeles, California. Thank you so much for spending your hard-earned money, for your time, and for making sacrifices to come see us tonight. It means the world to us. We love you so, so much. Night 2 at the Aronita Coliseum. Last night is the best night of my life. But I think tonight could top that. Tonight is gonna be the best night for sure. A huge fan of Lanny Main Mendoza came to see the band at the Aronita Coliseum. The Eat Bulaga. Dab Arquettes was spotted just as she exited door 7 of the venue. Main was seen with former Destined to Be Yours co-star Duong Cho Trivaneo, who maintained his distance as she gamely accommodated requests for photo ops with concert goers who recognized her. The Capuso actress, TV host was also accompanied by non-showbiz friends. Their group was sighted making their exit towards the red gate of the Arena de Coliseum. Jacob Jercito was among the early birds who arrived at the Big Dome's patron VIP area. As soon as he entered door 7 of the venue, a female teen fan tripped and fell on the floor in her haste to catch up with Jake and have a photo taken with him. After assuring the security marshals that she's fine, the girl proceeded to approach Jake, who readily took a picture with her. At a girl. Duong Cho was seen walking behind Maine when they exited door 7 inside her in at a coliseum. The two have been good friends since they closely worked together with Sheena Haliuli and Destined to Be Yours. Their trio represented Team Pelangi, which refers to the hometown of Maine's character in the series. Lanny lead singer Paul Klein was filled with mixed emotions since their two-night concert at the Arena de Coliseum marked the first time they performed in a venue as big as an arena. The big dome was filled with loud cheers as Lanny did their first set including Forever, Made in Hollywood, and Overtime. Lanny performed fan-favorite Good Girls right after Paul expressed how much he appreciates the huge turnout of their two-night concert. Paul is joined in this photo by drummer Jake Goss, left, and guitarist, vocalist Leslie Priest. Let's be kind to each other, Paul reminded the crowd. Then he sang Hurts, with lyrics that go, please tell me why it's easy at first, but then it all breaks, the more you love the more it hurts. Lanny thrilled fans when they unexpectedly transferred from the main stage to a makeshift stage located at the back of the patron area. This seemed to be their way of being closer to those seated in the lower box area and the general admission area. For this number, Paul closed his eyes, placed his hand on his heart, and paused for a moment before he started singing 13. The band certainly knew how to keep fans on their toes as they alternately mixed their slow songs It Was Love and Hurricane with more upbeat ones like Pink Skies and Super Far. Paul seemed close to tears when he played back-to-back -back emo songs Sign of the Times and Current Location on the piano. Lanny's drummer Jake Goss is married to Mariah McManus, who is a member of a church band called Mosaic MSC in Los Angeles. Better known by his moniker Lay, Leslie is the band's guitarist-slash-keyboardist-slash-synthesizer player, backing vocals. He is married to Jenna Priest. Paul Klein is the remaining bachelor in the band. He was dating gaff singer Dua Lipa and even met her in Japan right after Lanny came to Manila in August 2017. However, the couple reportedly broke up last January. Lanny capped off its concert with its anthema Kill Eyes, prompting fans to sing along loudly. Paul, Jake, and Lay took their time waving at their Pinoy fans before they finally left the stage. Before leaving, Paul promised, we will be back on 2019. Ogi Alcasid's daughter Layla was flanked by fellow bench models Reese Miguel and Matthew Custodio.
It was family time for actor John James Uwe who was accompanied by his wife Elisa Sazanova, baby Phoenix, and dad Harry Uwe. Harry Uwe.